France welcomed a newly promoted Netherlands side to Albertville as they began the defence of their title. A last-minute injury saw the withdrawal of Luca Pui just an hour before the tie began, meaning Adrian Manorino would face world number 374 Tiemo de Baca in the opening rubber. The Dutchman unfazed by the change in opponent and he began confidently. He took the first set on a tie-break. Despite the golf in rankings, Manorino was playing in his first ever Davis Cup match and his inexperience was clear to see. Debaca wrapping up a superb victory as the visitors took a shock lead. Richard Gasquet was tasked with getting the champions back on track against Robin Harsa. Pressure didn't seem to register with the Frenchman though as he coolly dominated the early exchanges en route to the first break of serve. And that proved enough to claim the set. The second set was tighter, but oozing with confidence, Gasquet was starting to play with style and would eventually take the set on a tiebreak. While suffering with blisters, Gasquet lost the third, but fought back heroically to wrap things up in four sets. Roger and Harsa were up next against two-time Grand Slam winners Pierre Hugerbert and Nicolas Mahou in the doubles. The first set was evenly matched, but the visitors would be left ruining three missed set points as the hosts took it on a tiebreak. Mahou, omitted from the final lineup last November, was playing with a point to prove, and he was instrumental in France doubling their lead as the crowd enjoyed doubles play at its finest. The Dutch pair took the third set and even surfed the fourth, but they couldn't close it out, with momentum swinging back to the hosts as they surged over the finish line. The two losers from day one faced off on day three, both looking for redemption. Manorino knowing victory would put the holders through, while Harsa tried to keep his country's hopes alive. An early break for the Dutch, the perfect start, en route to taking the first set. After taking the second, Manorino began to exert his dominance and he pulled ahead in the third. But Harsa pegged him back, taking it to a deciding fifth set via a tiebreak. At times the French looked on the brink of defeat, but Manorino's resilience won the day and the tie. They now face a trip to Italy in the quarters.